Hello ladies and gentlemen, my name is the Face of Stagist and welcome back to Hogwarts Legacy. In the last video, I was actually out and about trying to explore, but I was thinking uh, actually exploring might be best if we actually have a flying vehicle. So that has led me to the conclusion that we need to go ahead and get ourselves a magic flying broom. And luckily enough that we actually received a quest for exactly that. So that's what we're going to be doing for now. Unless I... Alakamora, these nuts. Freaking idiot. Oh. That is way too bright right there. Okay, and apparently we'll be able to upgrade our blue broom and whatnot. I mean, really. Everybody grab a broom and we shall get started. Okay. What if I do not have a broom? Mr. Clotten, your attention, please. Sorry, Madam Kagawa. Everyone, please welcome a new student to our flying class. Nobody cared who I was until I put on the mask. How to maneuver on a broomstick mm -hmm. As broom flight is, first and foremost, a means of transportation. This idea, okay. some of you have forgotten. Diving, rolling, and loop-the-loops will not be taught or in fact tolerated in this class. We'll leave that to professional Quidditch players, like the Toyohashi Tengu. Not a fan, I take it? Now, let's see how well everyone kept up with their practice over the summer holidays. For those who need a refresher, step up to your broom. Say up, firmly and clearly. Then kick your leg over and rest your weight on the seat. Okay. Thank you. Now, your turn. Up, 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 you stupid ratty school broom. Up. One leg over, so there's a leg on each side. None of that side saddle nonsense. A gust of wind will throw you right off. And if you hear my whistle while you're in flight, ground yourself at once. That is if I hear it. Good. Yeah. For your first lesson, fly through each ring in the courtyard. Do Wish take I had my care. Own broom. The brooms are school property. This will take some getting used to. I want them returned to. in one piece. Mm -hmm. Okay, nice. What can possibly go wrong? Well done. Now that you're acclimatized to your broom, let's see how well you manage with a more advanced exercise, shall we? Okay. What now? This next set of rings will take you around the grounds for more of a challenge. Okay. What a view! <laughs> Hello! Nice day for a flight! Fuck off, cunt. Ha, good. Bash your head in us. Nice. Where are me mum? Nice. Now, as long as there's no stupid flight restrictions, I'll be able to explore really well. Can I do drive-bys? That's what I want to know. Yeah, the Kraken likes the toast. That doesn't really matter, you know. Okay, yeah, this is all well and nice. Ah. Yes, it is. The possibilities are extraordinary. What do you want?
I say, I watched you fly through those rings. You seem to handle yourself on that dusty school broom well enough. I'd imagine you're ready for something a bit more challenging. But I'm getting ahead of myself. We haven't probably met. I'm Everett Clopton. Am I right in suspecting that a mm -hmm. Slytherin like you might be interested in making an escape from class? Mm. Kagawa seems strict. I wouldn't want to get into trouble. Kagawa won't even notice. Besides, a bird doesn't learn how to fly by staying in the nest. He's fucking annoying. Really? No. The tour is about to begin. Follow closely now. Right now, we're flying over the Transfiguration Courtyard. <laughs> Lovely as ever. Let's hope the headmaster isn't having tea by the window today. Mm-hmm. Nice to get above it all, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. Ahead of the gardens, the Hufflepuff common room windows just peek out. A bit claustrophobic for my taste. Okay. Everett flying so quickly. Here's something handy to know. Lean forward for a burst of speed. Helpful if you need to escape a tricky situation. Speed burst. Oh, now that's more like it. You sure you're not part hippogriff? Okay, nice. There's the famous bridge. Think of all the magic holding it up. I mean, look at it. And the owlery. That's a bit of solid architecture, isn't it? Flying tips and a jaunt around Hogwarts. This is quite the tour, Everett. Yeah. Whoa! That's Kagawa's whistle. This concludes our tour. Best hurry back. Mm -hmm. Hand in our brooms. Dismount here. Yeah. How the hell do I do the Ah, B. And where have you two been? Oh, hello, Professor. We were trying to get a bit of extra practice in. Hefty points will be taken from each of you for not following my instructions. Mr. Clopton, I am disappointed in you. You're in this class because you're still because you're still not showing yourself, or frankly, your broom the proper respect. But Professor, enough. Class is finished for the day. As for you, you do well to use better judgment in the future. I really didn't have a choice, now did I? Chin up. That was some rather good flying. Eh, fuck off then. Your cunt is cunt. Okay. Sorry about that business with Kagawa. But you have to admit, those views were worth it. I have no regrets. It was worth losing a few house points for that detour. You seem at home on a broom. Bet if you had a fancy model, you could fly laps around Imelda. She's Kagawa's favorite. Mm -hmm. I could show her a thing or two if I had my own broom. Hate having to return the school broom after class. Perhaps I have to purchase a broom then. If you can, you should. Wish I could. I recommend visiting Albie mm -hmm. Weeks at Spintwitch's in Hogsmeade. He's always looking to test new models. I'll keep an eye out for you in the sky. <coughs> I guess I don't really have much of a choice, but to go Rebellion. to Hogsmeade next. That seems like a rather fun thing to do. Uh, let's see, what does the quest say? The quest doesn't say a darn thing. So we're going to Hogsmeade. Okay. Now, there is this quest here. Winter Witch, uh, Sporting Witch, says variety of brooms. Olive Leanders. Okay. Let's uh, go ahead and go there. Sometimes 
sometimes it seems all wrong. How did you fare? If you're keen for some illicit spell practice, meet me outside the Defense Against the Dark Arts classroom. I know a discreet place near there. Okay, yeah, that's all well and good. Good day to you. I require assistance with a delivery and thought you might be interested. Please visit me at J. Pippin's Potions if you'd like to earn a few coins. Whoa. In the seventh floor corridor as soon as you can. I have an idea for somewhere you can focus on your studies away from prying eyes and distractions. Okay, apparently everybody has fought of me as soon as I've gotten the broom. Ah, new face. Rebellion. There we go. Don't mind me, I'm just looting your shop. Hello, Mr. Weeks, is it? Alby Weeks at your service. Welcome to Spin Witches. Apologies if you came by before and weren't able to come in. Shop's been closed since trade routes were mm -hmm. disrupted. Had to travel as far as London to meet with my supplier. And I've only just returned. Thankfully, with inventory. I presume you're in the market for a new broom? Yep. Got a few rare you weavers available. Ember dash, silver arrows. Wind wisps, too. No matter what broom you choose, you'll be pleased. They're all exceptional, both in quality and performance. Ah, uh, ha, ha, ha. Sounds quite the array of brooms. I'll have a look around. Thank you. What okay. are you looking for today? For those with a fiery broom, I saw a particular Hogwarts house pride. Okay, let's buy this one, I guess. You'll be thrilled with that broom, I promise you. Okay, great. Whilst nearly any broom will certainly be a mm -hmm. step up from the practice brooms in Kagawa's class, they all have their limitations. You seem mm -hmm. to be a flyer who might be interested in, say, some enhancements? Go on. Ha! Knew I was right about you! I think you'll be quite happy with the performance of any broom at lower altitudes. But you may notice that speed consistency tends to fall okay. towards the rise. I believe I can remedy this issue. I have some ideas for enchantments, upgrades, if you will, that will improve mm -hmm. the performance of any broom you fly. What I need okay. is someone to conduct the broom flight and report back to me so I can perfect the upgrades. As it happens, another Hogwarts student, Imelda Rays, is using abandoned broom courses for time trials. Clever girl. An ideal situation for collecting flight statistics. If you were to compete for the best time and succeed, then report back to me with how okay. you behaved. I could complete work on my first upgrade. What say? That's worth a try. That sounds intriguing. I'll see what I can do. Thank you. It'll be worth your while. If I'm right, the new upgrade ought to enhance brooms in every regard. And I can give you a special price. Okay, great. Control should be a bit of fun too. Go to the Quidditch pitch and Imelda Rays will sort you out. Okay, that uh, that what sounds quite lovely. Time, be sure to let me know. Okay. Of course it's restricted as a motherfucker. The room of requirement. Conjuring spell Evanesco, Conjuration Spellcraft. Confringo. Okay. Demanding delivery. I actually want that one because it is a side quest. And side quests generally tend to be a bit of fun. And I believe that was the side mission I was actually looking for. Oh no, no it wasn't. But okay, it doesn't really matter. We're going to... Opala! There you are, you sneaky little bastard. Let's actually go ahead and go over there. And see what he will actually give us. Come on in. Healing mm -hmm. potions are a speciality here, should you need any. Hmm. Hello, Mr. Pippin. You need help with the delivery? Yes, I do. 
A capable oh. student such as yourself should have no trouble making the trip to Cambridge. It's just south of Hogwarts. Okay. What do you need delivered? Fatima Lawang ordered a few invisibility potions. I used to go myself, but lately Fatima has taken to turning every visit into an argument. Constantly complaining about the quality of my stock. But how can I maintain excellence when she orders so often, giving me no time to brew? If you take this rather irritating task off my hands, I'd happily allow you to claim the delivery fee from Fatima. Okay, happy to help. I'd be happy to help with the delivery. You've no idea how grateful I am, truly. Here are the invisibility potions she requested. Hopefully she won't give you too much trouble. She's a talented potion mm -hmm. in her own right. I dare say I wouldn't mind having a look at her potion recipes one day. Okay. Fatima Long. Okay, yeah, that isn't really that bad. Okay, next stop. We're uh, actually going to pick up this quest Revelio. here. Let's just Revelio the fuck out of everything. Opa! Another one. <laughs> 